Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Bhavani Agarwal. My roll number is one zero one eight one five one four eight. My branch is electronics and computers. Hello, everyone. My name is Shetaj Verma. Uh, my roll number is one zero one eight zero six zero one eight, and my branch is electronics and communication. My name is Sudhan Khanna. My roll number is one zero one nine nine five zero one one, and my branch is electronics and computers. Uh, my name is Yash Tiyagi. My roll number is one zero one eight zero six zero one four, and my branch is electronics and communication. The title of our project is automatic measurement of garment sizes using image recognition. First of all, talking about the objective of our project, we are trying to automate the process of garment measurement, which is done manual in factories. Thereby, we are trying to reduce the error and time taken during manual measurement. since when we measure a large number of garments it is a extremely time consuming process and also leads to greater error after the introduction and need uh, so here uh, we are with the slide of the project road map so uh, in the in the subsequent slides we will tell that how we have developed the project so the very first uh, flow chart is the design flow chart so in the above flow chart the work has been divided into several categories starting with the garment and and the template selection problem and research phase on it comprises a selection of target group and a research about the current ideas that have already implemented and the newer ideas that can be used comes the design and development phase where we plan how hardware and software will be implemented after that we finally start developing our workbench for data collection and then implementation and building of model of for garment sizing the final code is ready we enter into the testing phase for different functionalities now talking about the project design and description first of all talking about camera calibration now we use checkerboard patterns in our camera before we can click pictures and extract the outline of it checkerboard patterns are used because they are easy and distinct to detect in an image and since they have sharp gradients in two different directions they are easy to localize hence being ideal for camera calibration the first step of camera calibration is to define the real world coordinates with checkerboard pattern then we capture multiple images of the checkerboard from different by keeping the checkerboard on a single place without moving it then after we have the 3d pictures of the uh, checkerboard we find the 2d pixel locations of these checkerboard uh, corners in the images then we pass the 3d points that we captured as well as the 2d locations that we found to camera calibrate method function to be able to calibrate the camera using the 3d points that we captured and the 2d points that we found the images show the same now coming to outline extraction whenever we have to measure a garment first we have to extract the outline but before that since every image has a different background any error we need to remove the texture from the background and using cut fill algorithm we have to ensure that the entire image is of a single color to reduce any sorts of error due to the background one powder contour lines of the garment are obtained it is necessary to identify the type of garment which is done in two steps number 1 garment template and matching the garment tain for type recognition and dimension extraction we are, we divide the garments into six categories including t-shirt shirt pants vest skirt and one piece dress for each category a garment template is defined the template contains highlights and properties of the garment including shape lines geography focuses pieces of clothing parts and sizes using these key measurements we recognize the garment we then move on to the second step which is the fan dimension extraction to identify the feature points of a garment we use the selected template to narrow down the region of aimed feature points a regular area centered at the feature point is the reg region where the potential feature point is located now coming to the outcomes based on the proposed method we developed a prototype system and carried a series of experiments to justify the accuracy 
and the efficiency of our method. We we use several garments to test the measurement of each type and the average relative error between the manually measured value and the auto measured value. And the results were quite promising with less than 8% error chance. The uh, template matching system was introduced to identify the garment type and the feature points automatically. And the size of the garment can be obtained directly from the feature points. Our method turned out to be way faster than the manual checking of garment sizing, thus reducing the time required for measurements and helping our customer choose the right size during shopping offline. We can also apply this method to the garment e-commerce for creating a better online experience and environment to the unified garment measurement system. It shows that the user experience and the convenience of the clothes online shopping increases and the returning rate decreases. Now, let me show you the video demo of our method. So after the outcome part, uh, here we present that how our final code work. So in the very first screen, you can see that uh, our code is automatically de detecting the different clothes which are in front of the screen. Like you can see that there is one jacket in the front of the camera and it is automatically detecting that jacket. And let us now look at the output of our project for that. Let's keep the clothing item on the workbench, click a clear picture. Once the picture has been taken, we we'll let it process it. After the processing is done, we can see that the size of the garment that we have kept comes out to be double XL. Thank you.